everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Angeline and I am the owner of Angelic Creations. So we are back with another Easter DIY video. So let's get started with the materials. So you will need your body piece, which I have already cut out my square rectangle, sorry, which measures 70 by 5 by 7 by 5. And you will also need a rectangle piece, which is on the fold. As you can see, I just folded it over. These measurements are 7 by 5 by 3. Okay, so the first step is to place your two pieces on top of each other, right sides facing each other with the raw edges aligned. And what we're going to do first is create a straight stitch going all the way across. Okay, so now that you have sewn your two pieces together, you should have something that looks like this. And the next step that we're going to do is we're going to create a top stitch right here going all the way across. Straight stitch, top stitching on top of the fabric. Okay, so you have two pieces now that looks the same. And the next step is to place these two pieces together right sides facing each other and you're going to pin them together because we're going to now sew them so you can get as many pins as you need but making sure that your seams are aligned making sure these two pieces are lined up together and also making sure that the body piece lines up together And after you have done that, you are now ready to sew. Okay, so now you have sewn both of your pieces together. You have something that looks like this. You wanna grab your scissors and cut off any extra fabric around the point so that it's easy when it's time to turn them right sides out. So you wanna get that exact shape. You can do the rest if you want, like cutting off the extra excess over here. Be careful that you do not cut your thread because you will have to start all over again. Okay, so this look good for me right now. I'm not going to cut too much off. So this is what I have done so far. This is how we're looking. And now it's time to turn our bag right side out. And to get this point exactly how I want it to really be pointy on the outside, I'm going to use the end of this paintbrush. And I'm going to just use this to straighten out the corners. I really want it to point on the end as much as possible. Okay, so I think that's it. Okay. Now you have your bag. And the next step is to place your candy inside or wherever you're going to place inside of your bag. I'm just taking a handful of candy and put it inside the bag. And I have some eggs as well that I had already filled. Okay, so just feel to your liking. And the next step is to close our bag. So I'm going to just take that egg out. And I'm gonna grab my ribbon. Got my ribbon piece here. I'm gonna close up my bag. And then I'm gonna tie a bow. And then we're gonna straighten everything out once we tie the bow. Okay, so our bow has been tied, so I'm just making sure it looks exactly how I want it to look. Turn it up if need be. Okay. Now that it's tied, just sprouting out what will be our green part, the grass for the for the carrot. I'm just making sure that it show more. That's all I'm doing. 
Okay, so we have our point, we have our top piece, which would be the green piece, and this is what we have. Now we got a cute little carry bag. Okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope that it was easy to follow, and I hope that you give it a try. So if you give it a try, make sure you tag me. And if you like it, just give it a thumbs up and share it with your family and friends. Stay tuned. We have more videos coming soon. Talk to you guys later. Bye.